you just need medium to heavy weights and a mat. Let's go ahead and just start with a nice little jog. Get our heart rates up, get our muscles warmed up. Although I feel like it's a little bit warm this morning for some weird reason. So I'll be using my fan and some jumping jacks. And crossover front and back. Open that chest up a little bit. Get a couple more. And go ahead and warm up your arms and your back just a little bit. I'm pivoting my back foot so I don't hurt my knee side to side. And opposite arm and leg, hamstring. Oh, that one's not so happy this morning. Get one more on each side. And let's do a little bit of hip opening. Just opening that hip side to side, a little balancing. And see if you can swing it. And other side, a little bit of opening. And side to side here. And a couple of squats, get that fluid in your knees moving. Back nice and straight, weight in your heels. As you get comfortable, go a little bit deeper. If you're sitting in the seat and you're about to sit right down in it. On this next one, add a heel lift, get those calves warmed up. Strengthen those feet, ankles. I'm gonna save the hopping because we're gonna do a lot of that later. <laughs> Last one, hold as low as you can. Even lower. Five, four, three, two, one. Little wider stance, inner thighs and shoulders stretch down. Open those shoulders, arms nice and straight. Try to rub them right next to your ear. Nice and controlled. Hold this one. Roll your wrist in one direction. Really warm your wrist up. And then the other direction. Other side. Tight fist and open up. Go ahead and pull your fingers down. Palm facing away. Pull them up. And then palm facing towards you. Fingers down. Other side, how's that leg doing? <laughs> Tired yet? Just stretching all the directions of your wrists and your fingers. And then right in the middle. Go ahead and get a lower back stretch. Other side. And then try to open those hips as much as you can, just walking back and forth. I'm trying to stretch in here. Go ahead and walk your hands out, get a nice little hamstring stretch and walk your hands out to a nice tight plank. And you're just gonna go from side plank to side plank. Just back and forth. Notice where your feet are. Your top leg is in front, other leg behind you. We'll do some of these later. Last set, each side. And then on your knees, you're gonna do a downward, uh, downward dog, bird dog, opposite arm and leg. Now curl your back toe. You're gonna lift up and do a little bit of a walk to the other side. Toe underneath, walk, other side. Then you're gonna go the opposite direction, putting the foot down, walking back. Let's do a couple of these, going forward and back. We are gonna do these a little bit later. <laughs> A little harder version. I just want you to get used to doing that, going backwards and forward. All right, and then into a nice tight plank. Walk your hands back. One last stretch right here. Go ahead and come up. We're gonna start with a hit training. Three moves, 30 seconds each, right in a row. 15 second recovery, three times. First one, 
options. Gorilla walk. Here, just going side to side. Two times on each side. Now, for those, especially on Friday class, try to load those shoulders up. One side and then back. That's your first move. You could do mountain climbers instead if you wanted to. Second one, surfer hop. Here, 45, back and forth. Low impact, you're just walking it back and forth. The last one, oh, I just forgot. Ski abs. Here. Four spiders. Three moves. Starting with gorilla or donkey kick sideways. Get ready. Start right now. 30 seconds. If you can, try to load those shoulders up. Going sideways. Stretching off to the side. Up and over. Fifteen seconds. Then you have ski hop. Five, four, three, two, one. Here you go. Forty-five degree turn. And then we have ski hop. Fifteen seconds. Down, side to side. Nice tight core. Fifteen seconds. Five, four, three. One, walk around, catch your breath, shake it all out. Keep moving, 10 seconds. It's a doozy to start with. You have five, four, three, two, one. Here we go, side to side. Fifteen seconds, halfway. Five, four, three, two, one. Yeah. Here. Thirty seconds. Fifteen seconds left. Yeah. 30 seconds. Fifteen seconds. Five, four, three, two. One, oh, walk around. One more set. Should be nice and warm by now. And then we'll get moving. Okay, 10 more seconds. Deep breath. Using all parts of your body right now. Ready and go. 30 seconds. Fifteen seconds. Almost there. Five, four, three, two, one. Last time here. Just for hop. Fifteen 
15 seconds. Fifteen seconds. Five, four, three, two. Oh, and one. Walk around. Grab some water. We're going to start with legs. Shake it all out. One or two weeks. Ooh, that was a doozy. Okay. Four exercises. Each one's about a minute. We're going to do three times. When we do cardio, four more exercises. Three times. So first one, side lunge. You can add tricep kickback if you want, if you have two weights. Up, overhead. You can add a heel lift. We stay to one side for 30 seconds. And then go to the other. You can add just one weight. That's fine too. 30 seconds one direction. 30 seconds the other. Get ready to start. And go. Here we go. Keep that back nice and straight as you go down. Head neutral. Ten seconds left on this side. Get ready to switch sides. Switch sides. 30 seconds on the other. Ten seconds left. Nice and controlled. Five, four, three, two, and one. Okay. Next one. You have twenty seconds going forward in a lunge, holding bicep curls. Then twenty seconds plie. Toes are out. Weight is straight down, 20 seconds here, and we'll do wrist. Then the same leg goes behind for tricep kickbacks. So same leg, one minute total, other leg, one minute. So go ahead, get ready for a forward lunge, and start right now. Hold, bicep curl. You could do a hammer, you could do a little pulse. Only 20 seconds right here. Halfway done. Get ready for plie, squat. Five, four, three, two, one. Out to the side, toes are turned. Straight down, I have you going. You're just rotating those weights forward and then out to the side. And then a couple forwards. We're almost there. Three, two, one. Leg goes behind. Tricep. 20 seconds. You don't have to use the arms. Halfway. Five, four, three, two, and one. Ooh, shake it out. Other leg forward to start. Just pretty much the same as what you just did almost. So get ready and start. 20 seconds right here. Ten seconds. We go to the side. Five, four, three, two, 
One, plie squat. Just a miss. Keep that weight close to your body. And then roll it in. in. Ten seconds. Five, four, three, two, one. And that leg goes to the back. Last 20 seconds. Triceps. Half way. Try to keep those arms bent. Just keep pushing your arms back. Five, four, three, two, one. Like bent at the front, at the top. Forgot you are straightening in the back. <laughs> that sounded kind of funny. Okay. You have one minute. Dragon walk. <laughs> we have dragon flag. We have dragon walk. Crazy names. Sort of warmed it up. Here's the advanced version. You can do what we warmed up, or you have push up knees or toes, forward, push up, forward, push up. So you're going to add a forward a push up, forward and back to each one of those bird dog pose. You could do shoulder tap and not move, or plank up and down. You can go to your knees on the bird dog. Find what suits you. We have one minute. Play with it. Ready? Here we go. Halfway. Almost there. Five, four, three, two, one. Take it out. Here's our last one. Sit up. And then we start back at the beginning with a side lunge overhead. So, this one. You have 20 seconds rope climb. 20 seconds. If you can, try not to put your hand underneath you. You can around your back. 20 second scissors. You can go higher. And then 20 second flutter. Scissors are crossing. Flutter straight up and down. So 20, 20, 20. See if you can curve your back and not use your hands. If you can't, you can do reverse crunch. Anything else. Get ready and go. 20 seconds rope climb. Reaching as high as you can. Ten seconds. Get ready for scissors. Five. Four. Three, two, one, scissors. Try to keep your chin off your chest. 10 seconds. We'll go to flutter. You can always be here. Three, two, one, flutters. Now here's a little bit easier. Make sure that lower back is on the mat. Ten seconds. Five, four, three, two, and one. Okay. That was round one. We have all those exercises two more times. So you'll get to know them. And as soon as you do, we will move on. <laughs> That's how it works. So back to overhead, one or two weights. You have 30 seconds on one side, 30 seconds on the other. Get ready. Go ahead and start right now. Half 
halfway on this leg. Sink into those side squats, side lunge, side squats. <laughs> Five, four, three, two, one, other side. I like to use as many muscles with each exercise as I can. 15 seconds. Because we have so many muscles. Five, four, three, two, and one. Okay, back to lunges. Forward lunge 20, side 20, back 20. Get ready and go. Here we are. Both knees are bent, weight is centered in the middle. 10 seconds, we go to plie squat. Three, two, one, toes turned out, body centered, not sitting in your seat, straight down. And have you going. Put your wrist in each direction. And go forward. And down. Almost there. Five, four, three, two, one. Behind. Tricep kickback. 20 seconds. Ten seconds here. Five, four, three, two, one. Shake it out. We're gonna start with the other leg forward, which is basically how you ended the last set. But that's okay. Back to bicep curls in the beginning. Let's start right now. If you do a hammer curl, you can do one at a time. However you want to do those. 10 seconds. Five, four, three, two, one, plie squat. Toes turned out. 20 seconds here. Just move those wrists in every direction that you can. Keep them that weight close to your body. And it's there, five, four, three, two, and one. Behind, last one. Go ahead and go. Let's keep those shoulders down and back, bending both legs, 10 seconds. Five, four, three, two, one. Oh, shake your legs out. <laughs> My legs are tired today and I don't know why. We're tired all weekend. Okay, let's go back to the dragon walk. However you want to do those, you can do shoulder taps, length up and down. You can just switch bird dog to bird dog. I'll give you halfway if you want to do that. Here we go. Get ready and start. One minute. Halfway, 30 seconds. Fifteen seconds. <laughs> Five, four, three. Two and one. A little bit of a brain teaser. <laughs> Sit up. Yes, we have one more round after this. Ropes, 
scissor, flutter. Get ready and start. 20 seconds. Try to get those shoulders off the map, reaching as high as you can. Less than 10 seconds. Get ready for scissors. Five, four, three, two, one, and scissors. Everything we're doing almost is core. So just as only one set of sit-ups in this bunch of exercises, you're using your core the whole time. Five, four, three, two, one. And the lunges, the side squats, definitely the dragon walks, all use your core. 10 seconds. Breathe. Five, four, three, two, and one. Okay, last time. Side squat overhead. Good news is that puts our cardio farther back. <laughs> so we don't have cardio yet. After this next set, we will have cardio. So side lunge overhead, one, two, wait. Get ready, start, break. Now, I'm gonna go to the other side first. Put your sides up a little bit. Over halfway on this side. 10 seconds. Five, four, three, two, one, other side. 30 seconds. Fifteen seconds. Less than ten. Five, four, three, two, and that was one. Roll your shoulders, stretch it out. Get ready for your lunges. You have five, four, three, two, one. Go ahead and start. Twenty seconds. Ten seconds. We'll go to the plie squat. Five, four, three, two, one. Plie straight down as low as you can. Twenty seconds. Fifteen seconds. I have to go a little deeper. Less than 15. <laughs> you know I can't count. Five, four, three, two, one leg behind, and go. Ten seconds. Five, four, three, two. One, shake it out. Last time, this side. Get ready and go ahead and start. Right now, 20 seconds. You can do a hammer, whatever you want to do with your biceps. Go out to the sides. Almost there. Five, four, three. Two, one, plie, straight down, 20 seconds. Ten seconds. <laughs> Five, four, three, two, one. Oh, last time, 20 more seconds. Let's get it done. Here we go. Triceps. Oh. Ten. Oh, I'm in pain. <laughs> it hurts. It burns. 
I'm gonna go lower though. Five, four, three, two, one. Oh, take it out. Oh. Dragon wax. Or whatever your variation of that is. Just keep your core nice and tight. Protect your back. You have one minute. I'll give you halfway. Maybe you could try your harder one for 30 seconds and then modify for 30 seconds. Get ready. Here we go. And start. Now as you do those planks, squeeze your quads, squeeze your glutes, squeeze your stomach. Halfway. It's a little harder going backwards. Fifteen seconds. Five, four, three, two. And one. So oh, we are there. Last exercise of this whole set. Good news, bad news. Because we have more after this. So, 20 second rope climb, 20 second scissor, 20 second flutter. You ready? And go. Ten seconds. You ready for scissors? Three, two, one. Right here. Twenty seconds. Turned around. Push your lower back down. Your hips up. Five, four, three, two, one, and flutters. 20 seconds. Ten seconds. Make sure you're breathing. Five, four, three, two, and one. Okay. Yes, we have eight Tabata. <laughs> We're gonna get through this. Six rounds. We're gonna load those shoulders some more. If it hurts to go in your shoulders, I'll try to give you modifications. You can always stay up and do jumping jacks, high knees, anything else. So, first move, you're in a squat, leaning forward, pushing yourself back to that squat. You can walk it out, walk it back in. That's a modification. Second one, out, plank, and right here. If you're in Friday's class, I encourage you to try to get on those shoulders back, on those shoulders and forward. Once again, lowering, loading those shoulders up. It's a doozy. <laughs> Six rounds, alternating. Get ready. And start. 30 seconds going forward, pushing back. See if you can have those elbows facing back toward you like a tricep, push up a little bit. 15 seconds. If you wanna add cardio, gotta go a little faster with it. Five, four, three, two, one. Go ahead and do some heel lift, catch your breath, plank, backwards, squat backwards. Five, four, three, two, and here we go. Plank up. Once again, you can walk it out, walk it in. Halfway. 10 seconds. Five, four, three, two, one and up, heel lift. 
Quad to the sore shoulders. Five, four, three, two, one. Here we go, forward. 30 seconds. This is halfway. Fifteen seconds. Five, four, three, two, one. Heel lift. Oh, this is squat for a minute. Five, four, three, two, one. Here we go. Fifteen seconds. Ten. Five. Four. Three. Two. One. Oh. My head heel lift or just walk around real quick though. Five. Four. Three. Two. One. Last time forward. Thirty seconds. Fifteen seconds. Five, four, three, two, one. Oh, heel lift. One more. Last thirty seconds. Get ready. You have five, four, three, two, one. Last thirty seconds. Fifteen. Almost there. Ten seconds. Come on, we can do this. A little harder. Five, four, three, two, one and done. Walk around. Shake it out. Grab some water. Two cardio. Down. One more at the end. That was a doozy though. All right, next one. I would like to say it's easier, not a lot. Still working these legs. Wednesday, I think we'll do more sit-ups. <laughs> Rest our legs a little bit. So, you've got 30 seconds. Lunge, lunge, you can just stay here. And then you have two lunge hops. Then 30 seconds on the other so shake it all out two lunges deep lunges two lunge hops get ready and start make them nice and controlled and then down into two lunges and then plyo really trying to explode as much as you can if you want to but I want you just to get more dynamic lift on here five four three two one switch side here we go in 10 seconds. Five, four, three, two, one. Shake it out. Okay. Now, this one, we practice slightly. You could do thread a needle instead. We're going to do a rotational reach with these. Elbow or hand. Top leg is in front. 
you're here, you're actually gonna pivot your feet, reach as far as you can, pivot back. So instead of keeping tight here, reaching underneath, you're actually pivoting your whole body, reaching as far as you can, coming back. This is gonna get your whole core. 30 seconds on one side, 30 seconds on the other. You can always go to thread the needles or hip dips. Get ready, get on your side plank, set, and go. So you're gonna have to stay nice and tight. Try to get that shoulder right above your wrist. I'm constantly correcting that. <laughs> Halfway on this side, feel that stomach working. 10 seconds. Five, four, three, two, one, other side. Same thing. Strong shoulder, pushing down on that floor, rounding your body slightly, a little bit of a hollow. 10 seconds. Five, four, three, two, and one. Okay. These ones are, I gotta be honest, <laughs> the next one's a little hard <laughs> for me. I'm trying to get more explosive with my quad. So, one minute, two controlled squats. And then two, trying to get those knees getting off the ground as high as you can. You can just stay with the squat. Or you can just do a little bit of a squat hop. You don't have to bend your knees, but like a box jump, it's really high. You've got to get those knees up to get your feet on there. We have one minute. Take it nice and controlled. Don't worry about speed. Control. Ready? Here we go. We'll save the speed for the Tabatas. Here, and I'm gonna set this up, and I wanna explode as high as I can. Getting all that power and effort that I can into those two square hops. And then nice and controlled. Over halfway. Giving myself a little bit of a rest for all out effort. Here's my rest. And then explode as hard as you can. Almost there. Five, four, three, two, and one. Oh boy. Shake it out, one more. How are we doing in time? Well, we might not have time for our last tabata. You know, you guys will all be sad. Next move. I'm gonna do a forearm push-up. My elbows are right under my shoulders. Lifting up, reaching out, and then I'm gonna try to do another forearm back. You don't have to do that. You could be on your knees. You can do shoulder taps. Reach, reach, plank up and down. Just come out and in, plank up and down. When you're tired, go to your knees. You're gonna notice that core as you bring those arms out. You gotta tighten your core really hard. You can just do a push up out, back. I'm gonna try forearm here, forearm out in front. Play with it. Here we go and start. So my elbows are going straight down and up, reaching as far as I can, and then back. I am squeezing just about every part of my body I can. Tight quads, squeeze your quads. Over halfway.
15 seconds. Five, four, three, two, one. We're gonna go through again on those last ones. You can also be in a plank here, stretching forward. Modify as you need. It's a lot of time on your hands or your elbows in a plank position. Go back to the beginning. Lunge, lunge, lunge hop, lunge hop. Get ready and go. So do I have a lot today? <laughs> I'm not gonna make it through the whole thing. I get excited sometimes. Okay. So we're halfway on this side. You have five, four, three. Two, one, go ahead and switch sides, other side, same thing. Nice and controlled. Make it each one count. So rushing through it. And breathe. 10 seconds. Five, four, Three, two, and one. Shake it out, lots of legs. Rotational plank, reaching through. 30 seconds on each side. Use about every muscle today. Get ready, skim that side plank, elbow or hand, and start. There we go. You'll feel if you, your phone breaks. We'll start rocking and shaking. <laughs> 15 seconds. Five, four, three, two, one. Other side, same thing. Fifteen seconds. Ten. Five. Four. Three. Two. And one. Okay. Squats. Oh, I'm running out of time. Okay. Two squats. Two squats. Hop. Get ready. One minute. Let's go ahead and start right now. Nice and controlled. Take that time and explore as high as you can. And then rest. Halfway. Fifteen seconds. Five, four, three, two, and one. All right, four arm push up. We are getting close. We have a four minutes. So, here we go. Planks, push ups, just trying to reach forward in some motion as you do them. You ready? And go. It's a small movement in the front. Unless you're able to go all the way down. This is something to work for.
Halfway, 30 seconds. Ten seconds. Five, four, three, two, and one. Okay. How much time do we have? We are gonna go back to squat hop and then rotational, pulling through on the plank, side plank. Those are our last two moves. We don't have time for all four, so we're just down to two moves. Let's do the squat, squat hop, and then side planks. Get ready, last time. I think the ones I actually don't want to do the most, but that means I need to do them better. I need to do them more. Ready? And go. <laughs> Those ones we don't like, we got to do even harder, unfortunately. My whole house is shaking when I do that. <laughs> Not soft. <laughs> Look at the elephant. <laughs> Over halfway. Try to land a little softer. <laughs> I'm just glad my feet are getting down. <laughs> Ten seconds. Five, four, three, two, and one. Last one, and then we get to stretch. Kind of a bonus. Side plank. This uses your whole core. Now I like this exercise. Okay, ready? Nice tight side plank, and start. Use those quads, squeeze your stomach, push down on the floor, engage your shoulders. 10 seconds left here. Five, four, three, two, one other side. Last 30 seconds. Fifteen seconds. Ten. Five. Four. Three. Two. And one. And that's it. Time to stretch. Good news is we're already on the floor. So we're gonna start on the floor. Why don't we start with our lower backs after all that jumping? Kind of compact your back a little bit. So, full shoulders on the mat, stretching your leg nice and gently over. You can turn the opposite way of your knee. Take nice deep breaths, relax. Bring that leg. Actually, go ahead and keep the knee bent. Bring it as high as you can into your chest and then try to bring it across your body and up same thing to the outside try to bring it out up and out to the side and then straighten your leg point and flex roll your ankle in one direction Roll on the other. Take a couple of deep breaths. As you breathe out, try to get that leg a little closer to your chest. Try to keep your leg as straight as you can. And bring that ankle over your knee, hip and glute. Both feet are flexed. Pushing your back knee into your 
ankle, ankle into your chest. And a quadricep stretch, same leg, right next to your knee. You can relax your head. And gently release that side. Lower back stretch on the other, same thing. Both shoulders on the mat. And bring that knee into your chest as far as you can. Across your body and up. And out to the side. And that leg goes straight up. Point and flex that foot. Roll your ankle in one direction. And roll your ankle on the other. Take a deep breath. As you breathe out, try to get that leg a little closer to your chest. And ankle over your knee, hip and glute. Really relax. Nice deep breath. And a quad stretch. I'll turn my body sideways. <laughs> the other direction. Try not to bring your leg up, just straight behind you. And gently release. Look at our shoulders. Almost done, shoulders. Arms are nice and straight, back is straight, pushing through those shoulders. And go ahead and get your wrist on our way up. Just rolling in each direction over those wrists. Fingers are spread nice and wide. Turn your fingers 90 degrees out. Going in each direction, and then gently behind you. And you can go to a forward bend and get your ankles and Achilles if you want to, if you have time. Got to run. Thanks, Marianne. Yep. Thanks, Brian. And then walk your hands back. One last stretch. And gently come up 